Hey, welcome to the Furry Marie Network. It's Marie, Sophie, and Marie's mom. And today we are going to do uh, a review of some cool things that we ordered for the dogs. And uh, so, five cool things that you maybe haven't seen or heard of. And we're gonna go over those in just a second. But first, I wanna say thank you to our subscribers. We're continuing to grow. We really appreciate the support. And um, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, again, the subscribe is just bookmarking us, basically. Um, but if you wanna get uh, an alert every time we post something new, then you'll need to click the bell as well as subscribe. So here's Murray, he's ready. He's, he sees that I've got all this stuff laid out and he's wanting to check things out. So one of the first things, we got this. Um, got it off Amazon. We'll put links to everything so that you can check things out for yourself if you'd like uh, at the bottom in the description. But this is called a lip mat. Now, I had never seen or heard of this until just recently, and some of his little dog friends were talking about this. So, um, when I looked it up, what I saw was they come in different shapes, different colors, different uh, little waffle patterns, and um, the basic theory of it is, you know, if, if I give my dog a spoonful of peanut butter, how long is that gonna take him to eat? A few seconds, and it's how many calories. Whereas if I take this and I put a spoonful of peanut butter and spread it over the whole mat, now it's like he got a sucker. So he's gonna use the same amount of calories, but it's gonna take him longer to lick it. So he gets to enjoy it longer without more calories. And of course, we're calorie conscious here because of his surgeries. So, and another thing about this is a lot of them have suction pads on the back. And so you can suction it in uh, the bathtub. And then the goal is keeping the dog concentrated on licking this so that they're not putting up a fuss while they get a bath. So we're gonna try this out. See, I have a feeling they're gonna be uh, fussing over it. There's two of them, so I'm gonna put a little bit more peanut butter on here. But we're gonna see if they like it or if it's too much work for them and they get annoyed. So, see what they do. Hmm. They seem to like it. Hey, I think that one's a winner. I'm gonna have to uh, try it out maybe in the bathtub. Uh, like I say, some of them come with the suction cups on the back. And um, so anyway, oh, and they are also uh, dishwasher safe. Um, I believe it's in the top rack so they can get all sanitary and everything like that. So I'm going to start getting the next thing ready to see what they think. And the next thing is called a lotus ball. And it's got Velcro down the sides. It's um, to put treats in. And they have to figure out how to get the treats out. So I brought some treats in here. Um, bought, brought some stuff in here off uh, last month's Toby Treasures uh, subscription box, which check out that video. We did a video reviewing that. Got these, and so we're gonna put a couple of these in here and see. I don't know now if they got that peanut butter going. He may not want to. Hey Murray, look, Murray. Mmm, Sophie, can you smell the treats? Here, let me take this away. They did some pretty good damage to that. Okay, mmm. Got two of them. Hold on, Sophie. I'm getting yours together. Sophie, come here. There you go. Get it. Oh, you already got your treat, Murray. Good job, Murray. Good job. Come here, bring it here, and I'll put some more in there. You gonna bring it to me? Did Sophie not get hers open? You gonna do it? Oh, oh yeah, he's got it. Oh, he got it. So the next thing we were gonna check out is this puzzle. And they have gotten a puzzle before, not this one. This one looks a little harder, so I don't know how that's gonna go. Um, 
But the other one, I hadn't seen these either, and some of his little friends were doing the puzzles um, and showed videos, and I thought, wow, that's really cool, but it looks hard. I don't think that he can do it. Well, he could do it. So I decided to get a more difficult one. I'm gonna put pieces of carrots in this. So let's see how this goes. This is uh, called Seek and Treat, and um, there's a couple of them with flaps and a couple of them with slides, so let's see what happens. <gasps> Sophie almost had one. Did she get it? Yeah. Thought I heard it. Oh. oh! Oh, oh, no. Look, look, look. You got to do it right here. Get it right there. Oh, he, he got it, but he didn't see the carrot. Oh, he closed it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got one. He got one. Right here. Oh, he's, he likes the slide ones. He got the other slide one. Look right here, Sophie. Look. Hit it with your paw. Hmm. That one's going to take a little more time, I think. Okay, another thing that we got while they're working on that is a new treat ball. Which, they have a treat ball, but not one like this. And uh, they really uh, like the treat balls a lot. So, decided to get them a new treat ball. That's something that they didn't... I mean, they're over three years old, and we just got them one recently. Again, we just didn't think they would like it. We didn't think it'd be that easy to, to play with, but um, um, they've liked them. So I decided to try this one. So there's a couple of spots on here. So they're pretty small. They are pretty small. Here we go. Ready? All right. See what you can do with it. Now this ball is um, called a Durabrite. Oh, Murray's back over there. He's wanting to get that. Murray, get over here, baby. Come here. This one, the holes are definitely much smaller than his other ball. So that might be a factor when you're checking out, like the first one, you might want to get one that's got um, bigger holes for them to learn. Because he already kind of knows what to do and he's still not been able to get anything out of it. Come over here. I'm not even getting anything out of this. Shaking it. Oh, oh, well I did that time. There you go. Okay, then the last thing that I have for today, Oh, you almost had it. Here are these dental bones. They're called belly bones. And they are um, yogurt flavored, yogurt, <laughs> yogurt flavored. And um, somebody recommended these to him. And so we're gonna give them each one. See what they think about that. These um, yogurt flavored dental care bones. So Murray just got his teeth cleaned about a week ago. So he's got to be sure and uh, keep up on that now that he's got them all pearly white. So this was just five things that maybe you haven't seen or heard of that we thought we would test out and kind of give a review. We'll write a description down below of what we think. We'll post some more remarks down there after they get a little bit more time going over them and um, links. So if you want to check out any of these things, you can do that also. So thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Watch. You have to do it yourself. Oh. <laughs> you had it open there, Sophie.
Let's hope we got one open. Different feet. 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 Oh, so we got them. No, Sophie. Good boy, Murray. <laughs>